Infinite Uptime digitizes factories. We basically walk into a factory, slap our hardware onto different types of machines, digitize all those machines automatically, and then our entire software and analytics solutions provides different value adds to these factory owners and their machines. Initially, when we came up with this product, you know, I'm a machining guy. I was born in a machine shop, so I made this. It's all metal, it's, you know, we, we built it on these machines right here in this Berkeley machine shop. And this is what I came up with to fathom and I said, you know, this is cool, this is awesome, but no one's gonna buy this. So we need to make something that's aesthetic, that's industrial design, that's, you know, waterproof, that can be used on these machines and that looks good. I wanted a solution, I wanted a design and manufacturing solution. And that's where Fathom came in. It took us two months working with Fathom to go from here to here to here through almost 15 different iterations of prototypes which would have normally taken about six months in a normal manufacturing scenario. So what Fathom did, you know, the big issue was how do we get this to be IP66 certified? And that's completely waterproof, rust proof, corrosion proof. There were a lot of constraints on the materials like how it's going to be molded, where it's going to be molded, how the light's going to shine through this material so it has to be uh, translucent. And on top of that, it also has to work with the glue that we use to, to attach these two components together. In terms of the connector, we went through several different iterations. We used gaskets, we used O-rings, and then we finally came up with a solution which doesn't use any of these, doesn't require any extra dyes, doesn't require any extra molds, but it's very simple where we just, you know, have a self-designed IP66 connector, which we designed with Fathom. And using 3D printers, we prototyped all these, you know, different parts. We didn't prototype the whole product to just test one functionality. You know, we prototyped small pieces, let's say just the corner of this, to, to, to simulate what that fitting is going to look like, or how that gluing is going to work. And similarly, you know, different parts of this product were prototyped differently on different machines so that we, you know, don't spend too much material, but we get really quick results. You know, within a day, we were already on to revision number three based on, you know, what we learned from the previous day. And we have data, for almost 5 million data points now on our database and we are learning continuously from this data. Working with Fathom was, I would say, number one was quick. You can get stuff done real fast using digital prototyping and digital manufacturing techniques. So it's really cool and we are having a lot of success. Mm -hmm.